everyone, my name is Kinga. We are in front of the building of the main library of the University of Science and Technology. Today we want to show you our library, tell you a bit about what we do and what you can find here. Enjoy the tour! and I am uh, director of the main library of uh, APH, University of Science and Technology. And I would like to describe you our library. So, it is one of the three largest academic technical libraries in Poland. It was established in early 20s of 20th century. Therefore, it has over 90 years. During this period, from the small library, which book collection had been building thanks to the gifts received from university's professors, it has grown to the major academic library. Its basic tasks concentrate on public services, services supporting researchers, and also on didactics and its own scientific researches. Since the 1966, the library have had its own building located on the head of AJH UST campus. In recent years, building has been expanded and renovated, which resulted in gaining of approximately 1,000 quarter meters extra space. Therefore, the library now has approximately 6,000 quarter meters at its disposal. The renovation was an opportunity to make important changes in organization, which resulted in modernizing the library and making it more user-friendly. As a part of modernization of the main library, the OpenStax Dome has been created. Since 1993, the main library has been using integrated library system VTLS Virtual. Concerning cataloging collections, it closely cooperates with Polish Central Catalog NUCA. We have about 40,000 registered users. We gather and share our collections and also provide services essential for conducting scientific researches and teaching process. We put more and more emphasis on electronic sources, making selections amongst traditional collections at the same time. The main library hosts the standards information point as well as the regional patent information center which provides access to uh, patent information. We support university authorities and work for the benefit of faculties by registering published achievements of HHUS employees and by providing them needed statistics and organizing data transfer to the central database portal. The bibliographic database is extremely useful in a unit parameterization process and employees evaluation. We initiate the creation of the institutional repository in our university, where currently our students' thesis are being transferred. Subsequently, in AJH UST repository, there will be also registered doctoral thesis, articles in journals published by our university, handbooks, monographs, administrative documents. From a few years, some of these documents have already been shared through the academic digital library. The library conducts researches in the field of librarianship, library science, bibliography, library statistics, a history of professional education, etc. We cooperate with other libraries on various fields. We are co-founders of a number of national-wide databases and we participate in a number of nationwide projects. So I hope that our activities are inspirational and I think it is worth to visit our library and also use its collections and services. Hi, uh, I'm Dominic. I'm a librarian working here uh, in this library. Uh, we have here five subdivisions uh, in which we are serving our users. We are 21 librarians here. Uh, so if you want to have a book, just come to our circulation desk and uh, sign up. Then you can make a request. Um, 
If you need any information, of course, we are waiting for you uh, at the information desk. Uh, if you want to have some textbooks, just go to our textbook collection, which is called here a free access zone. Uh, if you want to study in silence, there's no problem because we have a main reading room uh, which you can use it. We also have a special room for those who want to study in groups. For of course, if, if you need a document that cannot be found in Krakow, uh, you can contact our interlibrary loan office, they will help you. Uh, we strive to make our users' life easier, that's why we are digitizing our textbook collection. In this way, we can be more paperless, so welcome in our library. Hello, my name is Irena. Interlibrary loan provides access to uh, library collections that are not accessible in any of Krakow's libraries. Uh, this service is available for the employees and the students of our university. Uh, we also provide uh, services for other libraries and institutions. We lend books, uh, journals, uh, doctoral theses. Uh, we can send uh, copies of the articles. Uh, we cooperate with many uh, libraries and uh, institutions in the country and uh, abroad. Hello, my name is Pablo. Free Access Zone is 650 square meters comprised of 56,500 electronic and coded books. We provide many copies of the same title, mainly textbooks and student books essential for academic courses arranged in sections according to corresponding topics. Free Access Zone offers 27 places to study and work, either alone or in groups. You don't have to be our student to use this collection. Everyone has access to the shelves, but only library users can borrow books. Anyone with active library account can use the se our self-check kiosks to borrow books. Hi, my name is Michał. We're in the library employees, also known as Belletristic Library. Structurally, this is a part of the free access zone. Access to this library have exclusively employees of our university, both retired and active ones. We have here a bell dress, popular literature, guides, albums and uh, school readings. We have over seven and a half thousand books here and this number is still growing. Barbara. Welcome to the main reading room of our library. We provide here an open access to collection of handbooks and journals. You also can use in here other items requested from the storage. There are over 6,500 volumes of books and over 300 titles of journals on site. Handbook collection is sorted by sections which correspond to the faculties of the university. Journals are sorted in alphabetical order. We also have in here four individual work carrels. Users can book them by online reservation system available from our site. Moreover, we have here 10 computers, scanners and a copy machine. You will find here quiet and peaceful atmosphere. Welcome. My name is Dan. Welcome to the reference department reading room. This is the place where a user seeking information most often comes to get help. Our staff provide guidance on how to find materials or information on a given topic and how to use the library resources. Information is available here in the reading room but also on the phone or via email. Here our readers can use reference materials such as encyclopedias, dictionaries, statistics, guides, directories, etc. There are five computer stands with access to licensed databases and collections of full text electronic journals and books. Currently, the main library offers the academic community access to more than 60 databases and full text journal and book collections, the majority of them in English. A Wi-Fi network is open for those who prefer to use their own devices. Each month, 
the most recently obtained foreign books are presented in this sitting room and Polish books in the hall outside. Studying at an institute of higher learning includes developing the essential skill of searching for and evaluating information. The library staff run practical workshops during which you can learn about various information sources suited to your field of study. From time to time, we organize subject exhibitions in the library hall. You are welcome to come and have a look. My name is Agnieszka Podrazik and I'm Head Office of Special Collections Department. Me and my colleagues collect and circulate various types of documents here. These are standards, patents, cartographic materials, company literature and manuscripts, mostly doctoral theses. All collections and information sources are available in the standards, patents and cartographic collection reading room in which we find ourselves. Very important activity of the department is the Regional Centre for Patent Information, acting in the framework of the well-known European network PATLIC, supported by European Patent Office and Polish Patent Office. The centre provides patent information to all persons interested in it, students, researchers, entrepreneurs. We offer access to millions of patent documents, of course in electronic version, we use different tools of European Patent Office and commercial patent databases as well, like our Bit by Questel or Derivent Innovations Index. The users, with help of experienced librarians, can conduct all kinds of patent searches, like professional state-of-art searches or novelty search for trademarks and industrial designs as well. The Centre organizes trainings, workshops and conferences to promote the protection of industrial property. In the Special Collection Department, we conduct also standards information point. First of all, our users have an access to a complete set of Polish standards. It is about 90,000 of documents. Now, mostly, they are European and international standards implemented by Polish Standards Committee. The standards are available in electronic version on computer terminals. We also offer access to full collection of ASTM standards. Uh, we have also several thousand of German DIN standards here. The users can conduct their own searches using bibliographical databases such as Perinorm, uh, AAG Standards Expert or Total Materia. Last but not least, I would like to mention about cartographic collection. It includes several thousands of multi-sheet maps, topographical and geological, covering territory of Poland, uh, atlases, plans of important cities in Poland. Uh, these materials are used in the teaching process for students and academic staff. Uh, all our collections and information sources are available on-site, free of charge, to all interested users, of course, having active reader card. Thank you for your time. I hope you enjoyed this short tour and found some useful information. See you soon.